Welcome to the World Drone Market Channel. Today's video is a tutorial on how to connect a MIPI camera and the SkyDroid C12 gimbal to the SkyDroid H16 remote controller at the same time. The SkyDroid H16 drone remote controller is an all-in-one solution for long-range HD video transmission, capable of video, data, and radio control transmission. It features low latency, strong anti-interference performance, and a long transmission range. The C12 is a mini gimbal camera that integrates a high-definition visible light camera and a thermal imaging sensor, providing a clear field of view while also detecting heat sources. This video is divided into three parts. What products are used in this test? How to connect them? How to display the images? What products are used in this test? Products, SkyDroid H16, MIPI camera, SkyDroid C12, 5300 mAh battery. Cables, S. Bus Plus Power Cable, C12 Video Signal Cable, JST to TX60 Adapter Cable. How to connect them? Connect the MIPI camera to the MIPI port on the H16 receiver. The connector is GH1.2515 pin. Connect the C12's video output port to the Ethernet port of the H16 receiver using the C12 video cable. The C12 port uses a GH1.257 pin connector, and the H16 receiver's Ethernet port uses a GH1.255 pin connector. Connect the SkyDroid H16's S. Bus Plus power port to the power cable. The connector to the receiver is GH1.254 pin. Connect the JST to EX60 adapter to the battery. The H16 receiver and the C12 power cables are connected to the adapter. Both use JST 2.542 pin connectors. How to display the images. Short press, then long press the power button to turn on the remote controller. Open the Tool Assistant app. Click View Camera to see the MIPI camera feed.
Below the feed are options for taking photos and recording videos. In the settings, you can enable the crosshair and reversing guidelines. Then, open the Gimbal FPV app. If no image appears, tap the Switch button in the bottom menu, find the C12 icon, and tap it to enter. The C12 feed will be displayed. You can use the virtual buttons to control the C12's movement and switch between thermal imaging and visible light modes. You can enable the MIPI camera's floating window and drag it to reposition. This way, the H16 controller can display three feeds at the same time. That concludes our tutorial on how to connect the MIPI camera and the C12 gimbal to the Skydroid H16 at the same time. Thank you for watching and supporting us. If you have any questions about the video or would like us to explain a specific part in more detail in the future, feel free to leave a comment. Don't forget to follow the World Drone Market channel, we'll continue to bring you more drone equipment reviews, tutorials, and practical guides. See you in the next video.